We're demonstrating a, a color LCD panel that's been modified to accept standard TTL signals including the IBM Color Graphics Adapter, otherwise known as CGA, sometimes as RGA or RGB. Uh, we have some diagnostic software and I'm going to scroll over to the video test. You see, it does uh, many of the modes and uh, that you might see uh, used on a CGA, and was completely compatible with all the modes available. For a moment there, it popped up the word VGA. But this monitor was originally designed for VGA, but has been modified to do uh, CGA, so you could ignore that. It only displays that for a moment when it switches modes. So if you've got an old system, whether it's for manufacturing or medical or an old PC computer that's running a CGA video, this will work. And just remember, CGA doesn't have as many colors as VGA. And if you uh, zoom in to this part right there, you see it is doing uh, a, a color graphic CGA adapter. All right, so now I'm going to turn off this computer and show you that this really is an old ISA computer, a 386 with a, a real 8-bit ISA CGA card. It's got the old RGB video port here and the RCA video out there um, called the Color 2. So if this is the kind of video output you have, this monitor will do it.